Don't you just hate it when you're working on your RC car and you realize you have a broken part? Yeah, something that you just can't fix. So go over to your parts bin, try and find it, and it's not there. What, what, what do you do? What do you do? After you've tried literally everything, I mean, you just gotta make it yourself at this point. I spared no expense, guys, and I went out and bought the best, the absolute most capable 3D printer that I can find. And when I returned to that, I got this, the Ender 3. Not new, 40 bucks, some, some guy just that I met at the gas station. I mean, so, so it might not be new. New, 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 what do you mean by new? What do you, oh, new? There, it's new. I don't know what any of this stuff does. Okay, fan. I don't want to scan that. What is this, the antenna? So we can get a signal? This is the fan so that it can hover in place. What? Did you, I, look at what I just did. I could turn it on. This thing's battery powered. No way. Yup, battery powered. See? <laughs> Dude, I'm becoming a pro already. Now, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've never printed anything before. Look, oh, the on switch found it. Ah, uh, we need power. I think we're ready. It works! It works! The little fan is spinning up. What does all this mean? You're a loud little fan, aren't you? Yeah, sorry buddy. That That's that's not gonna last very long. It's still going! What? Okay. Whew. Now, there's a few things that we need to learn first in this 3D world before we can print. One is gonna be CAD. I don't know what that is. Two, we're gonna have to learn how to slice. And three, we're gonna have to learn how to infill. You know, you know, infill. Oh, this is where you hold the, 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 the thing, the filament. And we're gonna go with PLA. Let, let me, let me go grab it real quick. That, this, this, I don't have any sponsors, so just regular 3D printing filament. Thing comes like vacuum sealed. Nice. And we should just be ready, ready to print, right? oh yeah that makes more sense all right you know what yolo let's just do this and let's see what happens oh my god you guys need to push this go into a menu screen that has everything it's uh, print from tf i don't know what tf is but we're gonna print from there a bunch of different files that we could choose from i'm not sure if these are preloaded or if these are from the previous owner so what we're gonna do is just choose one and load a cell hook see what happens printer's doing something funny was i supposed to preheat something oh yeah it says it right there look it's heating perfect Whoa. what's happening what's going on what is that oh my god it's lowering It's pooping. Oh my god. Look at it, it's pooping. It's so cute. Come on, little guy. You got it. There you go. Push. Push. I don't think it's this is printing. This isn't printing, right? Nope. Okay, guess not. Okay, I'm just gonna take this caca out of the way. Yeah. Am I printing something? Is this is this printing? Guys. We're 3D printing. I realized, look, it's eating all of our little poop material. So we need to feed it with a little more poop material. And yeah, just when it starts getting low, I think we just tape these two together, right? Or do we melt them? Do we melt them together? Progress report. We're about a quarter of the way done and nothing has gone wrong. Am I, am I this good at slicing and, and catting? Are we even making anything, or is this thing just moving around? Oh yeah, look, I see the corner or something. Oh, I can't wait to have my load cell hook. All right.
right. Let's see. Just for the sake of sound, I'm, I'm gonna turn this off because this fan is a little much. Yeah, we had to put our own little touch to this too. So it looks like I have my, what, what, what is this called again? A load cell hook. What, what is this? I don't know what I made, but guys, this is some good material. This is tough too. And it like the smoothness, I, I can see myself making just a bunch of random parts, if not an entire RC car out of this. All right, this thing is gonna open up a whole new world of possibilities. A whole new world. I'm gonna have to start designing a few things because there's a few unique stuff that, you know, these shops just don't sell, like dual motor mounts and stuff. I might have to convert a few of these things into monster trucks or something, you know? Pretty impressive. All I did was hit a few buttons. I plugged it in, hit a few buttons, and boom, we have parts. If you guys like what you see, go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe. This thing is sick. We, we are now 3D printers. See so yeah. No, wait, that's a 3D printer. We are 3D printer operators. Owners. 3D printer owners and operators. Owner and operator of a 3D printer person. See so yeah. you.